Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today's code on the chopping block is PO451, Evaporative Emission System Pressure Sensor Performance. Don't worry, that sounds complicated, but it often boils down to a simple fix. In this video, we'll be tackling what the PO451 code means and how you can troubleshoot it yourself, saving you a potential trip to the mechanic. The PO451 code indicates a problem with your car's evaporative emission control. System Evap. This system is designed to capture and prevent gas fumes from escaping into the atmosphere. The Evap pressure sensor monitors the pressure within the system and tells the car's computer if anything's amiss. Check engine light. The most obvious sign will be the illumination of the check engine light on your dashboard. Fuel odor, you might notice a stronger fuel smell due to the EVAP system not properly capturing fuel vapors. Difficulty starting, in some cases, a faulty EVAP system can lead to issues with starting your vehicle. Visual inspection, start with a visual inspection of the EVAP system. Check for any obvious signs of damage to the hoses or wiring that could be affecting the pressure sensor's performance. Check the gas cap, a loose or damaged gas cap can cause issues with the EVAP system's pressure, so ensure it's tightened or replace it if necessary. Use an OBDI scanner, connect an OBDI scanner to your vehicle to confirm the PO451 code and check for any other related codes that could help pinpoint the issue. Smoke test, a smoke test can help identify leaks in the EVAP system. Introducing smoke into the system and looking for where it escapes can pinpoint holes or cracks in hoses. If your PO451 code is due to a sticky gas cap latch mechanism, a very small spray of WD-40 around the hinge can help loosen it up. Just be sure to wipe away any excess so it doesn't attract dirt, replace the gas cap. If the gas cap was the culprit, replacing it is a simple and inexpensive fix. Repair or replace damaged hoses, any identified leaks in the EVAP system. Hoses should be repaired or replaced. Replace the fuel tank pressure sensor if the sensor is found to be faulty. Replacing it will be necessary. This is generally not a DIY job for beginners as it can require specific tools and knowledge. Reset the check engine light. After the repairs, use an OBDI scanner to clear the PO451 code and reset the check engine light. If the repair was successful, the light should stay off. If you're not comfortable with any of these steps, don't hesitate to take your car to a trusted mechanic. They can diagnose the problem and get your EVAP system back in check. Conclusion While the PO451 error code can be daunting, understanding the potential causes and steps to diagnose the issue can make it manageable. Always start with the simplest solutions, like checking the gas cap before moving on to more complex diagnostics. If you're ever unsure, consult with a professional mechanic to avoid causing further damage to your vehicle. Thanks for joining me. Hopefully, this video equipped you to tackle that PO451 code. If you have any questions or fix-it tips to share, leave them down in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more car care know-how. See you next time.